Several sources report that CyberLife has provided Detroit police with a prototype detective android. Although police assistant androids have existed for several years now... <gasps> oh shit, Marcus! Oh my god, we're not in the right zone. Do they know? Can they identify each other even if there's no chip? I'm enjoying this coat we've acquired. I feel like we're now in Watch Dogs. <laughs> this place will be in the free. Find Jericho. Okay, check the symbol. Okay, I don't know what that is. Look for the graffiti. They missed her. Could you spare some change? Bitch, I ain't got no change. Oh, hey. That one. Yeah. This one. Yeah. Do you need me to... Hang on. No, no, no. This. That's the symbol, right? Then I need to find... Okay, that one. Where is it? It must be down here, right? Fuck. Android only. Oh, I almost went down the wrong one. Blending with the humans. Excuse me. Can I go down? Which, uh, hang on. Oh, sorry, it's this one. I like how the androids have to use the stairs and then everyone else gets to use the escalators because they're lazy fucking assholes. Oh, it's over there. Was, uh, was Watch Dogs 1 set in Detroit? Is that why I'm having like massive flashbacks? Is that, is that, is that what I'm tapping into at the moment? Hello. There it is. Chicago. It's set in Chicago. It just feels... Very similar. Then again, I suppose it is a lot of similar buildings, subways, and rain. So I think you probably understand why, as an English person, I would confuse the two. Um, I'm not sure if it's over here, but I'm just crossing whilst I, whilst I can. Uh, I'm looking for... Hang on. Oh, it's there. It's literally there. Lol. Thanks. Just crossing at the wrong time. Blend in with the humans. Humans. I sound like a Ferengi. That. Okay. I, I'm trying to find the next graffiti. Hang on. Wrong. Uh, hang on. How do I? Hello? Do I have to be... How far away do I need to be for this? Oh, there we go. I'm apparently in the right place now, standing in the fucking street. Uh, ah, there. Robot. Okay. Sorry. You asked me earlier. I haven't got anything. Terrible answer. Um, uh, oh, I don't know. It could be down here. Nope, it's not here. Okay. Oh, hang on. No. Not like graffiti. I suppose as well, the graffiti Watch Dogs 2, there's like a lot. So you might see why I'm confusing them. Let's have a look and see if it's over here. I'm looking for like a... What was it again? Oh yeah, hang on. Behind a fence. Is 
so we can't go there. Okay, so it's got to be in here. Is it in this bit? I'm not seeing... I'm seeing a robot. That does not mean it's not in there. It just means I can't see it. Oh, I don't think it is. Oh, shit, I went too far. Just chill out, man. So, um... can't like get in there I don't think it is in there oh shit sorry so it must be oh it's there it's there it's all right I overshot oh I can't I can't I can't get up the curb unless I use this bit okay oh no no wrong one just desperately trying to find the right button for scanning um there and uh, hang on. Where's the one I'm missing? Oh, there. Oh, fuck! It's behind the. It's behind that bit of wood. Bastards. Okay, in we go. Um, right, hang on. Let's just take this fucker off. And give it a little cheeky scan. Oh no, that's we've done that one, it's this one. Clue updated. This is a long way to go. I suppose they don't want anyone to find them, so that's probably fair. But it's a fucking ball ache, personally. Oh, it's up there. Easy. Oh. Too oh there's a shot. Too too far away. One. Uh two. somewhere here? It's like distorted here. I need to get up on something to have a look. Yeah. Bollocks! Okay. Do you want to take a... No? Okay. No. Um. Oh, hang on. Hello. I was right. Whoop. So then uh, we're going to go up. Oh my god. Hello parkour. Suddenly. Oh, and there's the last one. Like, suddenly amazing at parkour. This is what I wonder is like none of them have hu superhuman strength. And shit. Or Kara could have punched Todd in the face. Versus just dodging him and then shooting him. But I don't know. Maybe, maybe they do. Maybe I just didn't tap into the right options pre-construct I would like to go for this wall run please yeah that sounds fine how viable is that execute I mean if you can pre-do everything then Fucking hell. I, to be fair, what model were we? Because didn't they suggest that we were like an all-in-one security kind of unit versus, I suppose, Kara's more of like a homekeeper one. Which might explain why we're a very good, or we will be a very good vigilante fighter dude. Whoop! He just does a bit of everything quite nicely. Pair store. Oh, hello. Every time, every time, I keep doing the wrong button. I keep changing the point of view. Actually, he did need, uh, he need, did need to be strong because he had to carry Carl about, didn't he? So, yeah. Uh, 
I suppose Carl did go for the good unit. The expulsive unit. Um, am I missing it? I, probably. Is it in there? Where I have to go? I don't see anything. Let me come out of that. Let me come out of that and... Oh, uh, hi, excuse me. There's an android here. What the fuck? Huh. Okay. Doesn't seem to do much. So, what else is there? Is there one I've m well, there were that clearly is the one I've missed, but God knows where. Oh shit, there it is. I see it, I see it, I see it. God, they're a bit fucking awkward. My poor little brain. Right, oh god, here we go. Pre-construction. So, uh, we're going to go with that. Whee! Then, uh, I guess that <laughs> then up there you would be too high you would be too high Carl oh god compute there we go that sounds good to me go for it Marcus Obviously, it does not compute if anything breaks, but it works. Now, fire, thank you for your Prime subscription. So, I'm now in here. Oh, this is great. Oh, no. Hello. Oh, no. Um, why is the music doing this? Why would you? Why? Why? Uh, I think. Oh, hello. Hang on. And now we're in Hellblade. <laughs> All right. Oh, for God. Keep still. Keep still. Keep still. Fucking hell. There. And now we're going in here. Right? Yeah. hear something. What is that noise? Hmm. Oh, it's a boat. Jericho's a boat. Reach the boat. Okay. I broke the bridge. Bad times. Fuck. How the fuck do I do this? Uh, oh, hang on. I might be able to get up here. Uh, oh, hang on. Uh, jump. <laughs> okay. a bit creaky. I can't say I'm pleased about this. Oh, dude, are you gonna like get on a crane and drop down? It's just this is too much. This is too much, man. Uh, 
I'm not feeling happy about this. Dude. What are we do what are we doing? What are you doing? I'm just gonna jump. I suppose there is water there. Someone's been playing a lot of Assassin's Creed recently, haven't they? I wonder what David Cage's favourite... Also, oh, oh shit, we lost the coat. In fact, I wonder if David Cage is a fan of Ubisoft, because that's the Watch Dogs like Duster coat, slash a bit Fallouty, combined with Assassin's Creed bollocksing about. <laughs> It does mean we get the ass back, yeah. Calm down, Twitch chat, jeez. Okay, what what is that? Oh, it's a torch. Oh, I like how he hasn't actually got a top on. He's just kind of made his own top out of his skin. But it's a tight top, ladies and gents. Oh, actually, just peeps. Just peeps, because I know you're all appreciating dead ass. And now you've got a dead, dead chest as well, apparently. Jesse Williams is a very attractive man. This is fair. Um, so I have a couple of choices of doors, I think, here. Oh, oh, oh my. What's this? Explore the boat. Um, what's this? This is bust, right? Oh. Now I'm getting, like... Resident Evil vibes. Also, there's something in here with us. Android on the run. Oh, wow. That came out quickly. Runaway machine corns panic in Camden. Oh, no. Wait. Hang on. Camden? Tell me more. Oh, no. Detroit area. Okay. Sorry. Camden is... Uh, Camden Town is a, is a London district, I think. But then again, America renamed a lot of things, uh, or took a lot of names over. New York. New Hampshire. So... Okay, this is literally about Kara. Just saying what's happened to her. There's no mention of the child. Yeah, there's no mention of the child at all. Just says she's a fugitive. Android astronauts to explore Io. Oh, as in uh, Jupiter's moon, Io, right? There you go, one of Jupiter's satellites. Sorry, we don't call them moons anymore for some reason. Much like Pluto is not a planet anymore, or it is, or it isn't. I don't fucking know. Um, NASA are very excited about it. They Oh. The androids would work on Io for seven months before being destroyed by the extreme conditions of the planet. There is no return journey planned. Oh, I bet they love that. Oh, dear. Okay. Let's go out of here. Um, God, this, this boat is fucking huge. Maybe I should start... Hang on. I'm going to go back to where I started. Start with the doors there. This is not where I came in. I came in here, right? Here we are. So, was there a door in here? Yes. No. That's unavailable. Oh, shit me. The boat goes on. Oh, the boat goes on for quite a wet. Oh, God. This one's open. Oh, no. That's where I came in. That's where I came in. Okay. And then we can't go up there. That's fine. Can't go down there. There's the one I was looking for. It's very Resident Evil 7. I am fucking displeased. But maybe that's it. Maybe he's been playing a lot of games and adding stuff in. Like maybe he's gone, I like this setting. Maybe we'll put it in a game. Make it work. Make the room. 
Nope. Okay. If they're all fucking locked, this is going to be very easy. Bollocks. That's okay. Nope. Good. We are being funneled a certain way. Oh my god, please! Fuck you, Resident Evil! This is not a Resident Evil game! Why are you here? I hate you. Why? Why would you do that? I'm just recovering. It's just like the aggressive violins as well. I knew it was gonna come, I just realized it was gonna come that soon. I was busy thinking about how, oh, how games work and, and references and, and things. Oh, we're gonna have to go this way. Shit. Okay. I almost, almost pissed myself. Uh, no, I didn't. It's fine. Oh, mother. That almost took me out. Where, is it? Where did they go? Not in there. So they're obviously in here. Alright. The only door that works. Brilliant. Fuck's sake, what is this? Damn it. Oh, steady. Oh, fuck. I might have broken the boat. I broke the boat. I broke the boat. I oh, oh, bollocks. Oh. That hurt me. That hurt me a lot. That was like right on my spine. <sighs> Somehow we're okay though. I suppose we are a bit more resilient than anything. Did that? Oh, oh, fuck me. Hello. Oh. Welcome to Jericho. Hi. I guess we found them. 89% completed. In fact, if I have a little look out here when it loads in, I only missed a couple of little bits. Oh, I didn't read. I don't think I read an article. That's literally it. And then something in the station and something over there. Isolated events. Public opinion is sceptical. It's been sceptical the whole damn game though so you know not too fast um at this point right let's move on ah it's connor i recognize the death metal with hank oh, hey. plastic with you Listen, I got a shit hot tip for you. Number five in the third. Lickety split. That Philly's one hell of a chaser. You wanna flood it? Last shit hot tip you gave me sent me back a week's wages. <laughs> Come on, this is different. It's a hundred percent guaranteed. You can't go wrong. Yeah. Uh, all right, sure. Let's scan. Let's see who the fuck he's meeting. Pedro Abdar, criminal record of illegal gambling fraud, unemployed, born 2005. I briefly looked at that and went, God, he's very young. And then realized that we're in like 2030 something. <laughs> All right, I'm in. Damn straight. Hey, I won't regret this. You give me money to gamble. What is your problem? Don't you ever do as you're told? Look, you don't have to follow me around like a poodle. Uh. 
just wants to be your friend. Apologise for behaviour. I'm sorry for my behaviour back at the police station. I didn't mean to be unpleasant. Oh, wow. You've even got a brown nose and apology program. <laughs> As if Cyberlife thought everything, huh? Here you go. Uh. What, uh, what, are we, what are you eating? Is that... Oh, chicken, obviously. Chicken! Oh, no, it's a hamburger. This hamburger has 1,680 calories inside, Hank. It has 2.2 grams of salt, which is more than your recommended daily allowance. It probably isn't, but I don't know what that is. I certainly know that this is pretty much most of your daily allowance of food in one fucking go. What are you doing, Hank? Thanks, Gary. I'm starving. I'll leave that thing here. Oh, not a chance. Follows me everywhere. Bruh, bruh. Can I also talk about... I need to reconcile with him. Can I talk about this, which says, food prepared by a human. Our chicken was born with two legs and two wings only. Bruh, 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 bruh. Oh, now I want a burger. Cholesterol. Your meal contains 1.4 times the recommended daily intake of calories and twice the cholesterol level. You shouldn't eat that. But he's got to die of something. Friend? I've got friend with Hank! Yes! Uh, enjoy your meal. Enjoy your meal. Thank you. Oh. About Connor. Sure, let's try it. Let's see what happens. Is there anything you'd like to know about me? Hell no. Well, yeah. Um, why do they make you look so goofy and give you that weird voice? Cyberlife androids <laughs> are designed to work harmoniously with humans. Both my appearance and voice were specifically designed to facilitate my integration. Well, they fucked up. <laughs> okay. Hank and Androids? Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Why do you hate Androids so much? I have my reasons. Oh shit, is it family related? This morning, when we were chasing those deviants, why didn't you want me to cross the highway? Because you could have been killed. I, and I don't like filling out paperwork for damaged equipment. Oh, sure, Frank. Frank? Hank. Sure, Hank. Sure. Frank? Where the fuck did Frank come from? Maybe I should tell you what we know about deviants. You read my mind. Proceed. We believe that a mutation occurs in the software of some androids, which can lead to them emulating a human emotion. In English, please. They don't really feel emotions. They just get overwhelmed by irrational instructions, which can lead to unpredictable behavior. Emotions always screw everything up. The androids aren't as different from us as we thought. <laughs> you ever dealt with deviants before? Flashback. Flashing back. My mind palace. Back. A deviant was threatening to jump off the roof with a little girl. I managed to save her. So I guess you've done all your homework, right? Know everything there is to know about me. Uh, truth. I know you graduated top of your class. You made a name for yourself in several cases and became the youngest lieutenant in Detroit. I also know you've received several disciplinary warnings in recent years, and you spend a lot of time in bars. So what's your conclusion? Uh, I'm gonna go with Sincere. I think working with an officer with personal issues is an added challenge. But adapting to human unpredictability is one of my features. I just got a report of a suspected deviant. It's a few blocks away. A what? You should go have a look. I'll let you finish your meal. I'll be in the car if you need me. Oh! 
tiny bit of shade there, maybe, from Connor. I, but I like this. I think we're getting there with Hank. 